Hello and welcome. This is Mouse Gunner, and we're back with some more oxygen not included. And at the moment, we're trying to improve our power situation with a coal generator. And then I think my next priority, once I get a bunch of other things done that are currently in production, I would like to get on dealing with these gases. We have some hydrogen gas in here that's not breathable. We have a little bit of contaminated oxygen, not a lot. But I would like to deal with both things. Now, the hydrogen gas might actually be good because there is a way to convert it into power. This hydrogen generator here being uh, what we would use. But I really want to see with the gas piping system what all you can do with it. So right now, I think... And I'm not sure where it was. It might be under... Refinement. We have a water purifier, which uses sand to pur uh, purify contaminated water. We don't really have a ton of that. I mean, technically, we produce contaminated water down here. So we could have a loop system going on that would be more sustainable with our water. But we also have, and it's not here. Maybe it is under plumbing. Let me just take a look here again. So we've got... No, it's not there. Oh, it's under auction. That's right. We have... A air deoxidizer. So this reduces the threat of disease by filtering contaminated oxygen out of the air. And then we have this, which filters carbon dioxide and removes it from the air as well, and which would be nice, because we do have a lot of carbon dioxide down here. Now, some of that I'm hoping we'll, we'll start getting oxygen production up and be able to take care of. But that would be something that would be helpful for the future. But definitely this might be good as well. And I just want to see how the, the gas pumping in general works. So that's what we're going to work towards. But right now, I think resources are a little bit on the short side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a ladder. And I'm going to build it down to there. And then we're going to select to dig this area. This is another potential source of water. So I think it's good to dig down to it. Matter of fact, why don't we just keep going with that and then continue to dig as well? Oh, no, I didn't want to dig like that. Okay. Now, I do have a lot of things queued to be dug here. There is a little bit of uh, copper ore here, there's also that to be swept. Looking around, harvestable stuff. I mean, we have a lot of stuff that needs done. And just isn't getting done. Uh, I still am short a bed. So Jack has nowhere to sleep, which is bad. We have a lot of stress going on. What is May's problem? Interrupt to sleep and tired. So the real problem here is we don't have enough oxygen in this, in this room. So they're waking up, they're getting interrupted sleep, and they're gasping for air. That's bad. We don't want that to happen. So, we're going to try and work on that. As a matter of fact, to get that started heading in the right direction, I think we're going to need to really up the algae producers. And we're going to need to prioritize those big time. So, let's get on that. And as long as they don't get interrupted during the night, Sleep-wise, which doesn't appear they are right now. We might be okay. Okay, so let's get on some of these jobs. We have power problems. I'm trying to get the, the coal up and running, though, so that we have less of that. As far as I can tell, coal does not produce pollution, not at the moment, anyway. The main real thing we have is this hydrogen, which is being produced by this, seemingly. It didn't say that it is. I mean, unless I am... Um, not reading that properly. Yeah, see, I don't see anywhere where it says that it produces hydrogen, but clearly it is because this was not a thing before. Okay. And we need to bring Algae, possibly. 
which I wouldn't be too surprised if we're short on uh, that. So I am going to start getting the algae production up a little bit. Or digging, I should say. I guess we might as well dig out what we can reach here. And I am going to prioritize it. A little bit of it, anyway. Okay, so we just completed some more research. Let's go ahead and take a look at the next thing we got. So I just finished the temperature modulation because temperatures are really high in some areas and we need to deal with that. The next thing I'd like to do is probably pressure management. Alternatively, we can do insulation. Okay, so this is insulation. I'm not sure we need that. Advanced filtration. This is where we're going to have gas filter. Ah, okay. So this is exactly what I want. Uh, the ability to sort the gases. I wasn't sure if that was something we could do. Um, but now that I see that we can, that's for sure what I want. Because in our main area, we have different types of gas. And I want to be able to send one type of gas one place and another type of gas another place. And to be able to do that, we're going to have to do that. And that's why I'm prioritizing that. So let's get on that. We do have our coal production up. Let's take a look at our power grid. So I don't know. Uh, there might be a way to take a look at this math without taking a look at this. But I think we might be okay. Let's take a look. So, so we've got this, 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 all that. Our consumers... Yeah, see, I don't know if it's really totaling it up anywhere. I mean, maybe it is somewhere. All right, we're low on algae again, but that's okay. We're, we're, we're working on it. All right, hopefully that will deal with some of the oxygen. We need another cot, which I don't currently have. Uh... Why don't we just... Under furniture. I'm just gonna stick it here. This isn't the, the best place for it, but it's it's fairly oxygenated, and... It will do. And I'm gonna prioritize it just so it gets done today. Because we have so many things going on in the base. Okay, so, looks like we have completed a lot of the tasks that I've assigned, I mean, outside the digging, which they're still way behind on. But just maintaining the rest of the base and doing a lot of the things that I've been telling them to do. The fact that they have to run all over the base, you know, that is probably a big problem. I'm going to have to start getting more resource, co resource collectors going, so... Why don't we do that? Storage compaction. Stick a lot of that in there so that they don't have to run all over the base collecting things. And I guess we can prioritize it too. Just so it gets done. And another thing I'd like to prioritize is not getting prioritized. And I now realize. And this is why we're not sweeping up the food that I keep telling them to sweep up, is we don't have a ration box. So I'm going to work on that as well. We still also don't have a place for them to eat. I don't know. It's just like I keep having to prioritize things, which is probably not the best way to do things, but... 
All right, now I'm just going to say all. All. And all. All right, now we should start dumping things in here. And hopefully that will make things work out a little bit better. And hopefully our oxygen production is looking a little bit better. I mean, still not great in here. What I could do is maybe close off these areas so they're not as well oxygenated. The only problem with that is as people have to come up here, they're going to be choking, choking out. So I don't know. I don't know if that's ideal. Okay, it looks like power generation is much better. We've kind of gotten a stable position. So we're not having to constantly work on these manual generators. And if that's the case, I'm, I'm going to start considering dismantling this. Okay. So we need more algae, so I'm going to have to prioritize that yet again. It looks like. So this is, should all be algae here. I'm half tempted to get rid of these things though, because they're very inefficient, I think. Comparatively. I mean, the, this is probably the most efficient. Matter of fact, let's take a look at that. There might be a way of comparing. So this this costs us the same amount of power. And it's the same amount of water as opposed to algae. Uh, oxygen plus eight eighty. Definitely more efficient. Ah, here we go. Hydrogen. I that's what I thought. Okay, so heat definitely better on heat. Hmm. Alright, well, I'm not sure, but I, I'm thinking that this is more uh, more efficient, for sure. Uh, this doesn't produce nearly as much oxygen, but it does take down carbon dioxide quite a lot, which is something that we definitely need. Alright, well... I am gonna think about that. But this is, you know, what... Let's just, just de let's just deconstruct them now. I'm sorry, but they just produce they they just consume so much algae, and algae is a finite resource, and it's better I think used on these, which suck up carbon dioxide, and I think we're better served with these producing producing. I mean, it produces hydrogen, which is a byproduct we really don't want, but. I think we're better off in the in the end. So what I'm gonna do is just build tile. Comes across here. And I think I'm gonna put that here. Because we already kinda have the hydrogen pumping up this way. I think that's, you know, for now the ideal situation. I'm gonna have to think about how I wanna do. The, the gas sorting and everything. I think probably the ideal is we find a storage area, maybe over here. We've been digging this area out. I figure might, well, might as well. While we're at it, you can dig all of this stuff too. Now that we're building a platform. So, I'm gonna prioritize. Make this a high priority. Oop. Now that we have Okay, so just the cooking station that has insufficient resources and it's waiting for the micro musher. So that's that's good. Uh, all right, now that we have that taken care of, more or less. Yeah, we'll we'll get on the energy, uh, the oxygen generation, because you know right now that's that's a problem. 
You know what? I'm putting this up here, though. That's not going to really help us, is it? We're going to want it down here. I mean, that's okay that we built that platform. But now that I think about it, I think the best place for this is actually here. Because the oxygen is going to get where we need it. I do have to consider, though, that I need piping. All right, let me let me take a look at this situation. I mean, right now I'm not this. It's nighttime, so I, I can't really worry about it. But let's take a look at the liquid and pump plumbing. So we want water, and what I may have to do is pipe it down this way, build flooring in all this area, and then pipe it over to here. Alternatively, I could set up another pump here. Connect it to this, just for now, just have one inlet. And then, maybe in the future we do that connection. Hmm. Alright, well I need the resources, I think, so why don't we... Why don't we work on that? Prioritize all that, so we dig that out. And get our ladders produced and all that. Yeah, so this guy's having problems. Okay, so May is still pretty stressed. Ooh, what's going on here? Um, stifled. Overheated. Okay. So heat's a problem. Alright, we're going to need to deal with that right now. Uh, that is under this. Okay, so first off, dissipates a small amount of heat. Then this. Pulls the gas pipe through it, but outputs heat in its immediate vicinity. Okay, so... We actually have to pipe the gas through it, though. This is just a little bit. This is big time. But... Okay, 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 okay. I think I, I figured this out. So what I want to do is I want to have a couple of these here. Okay, that's good. Then what we're going to need to do is I'm going to need to do gas pipes. We're going to pump the air from here in our living area up to here, get it cooled, send it back down, and then back through. That's game plan. And we're going to need to work on that relatively soon. So, with that in mind, uh, prioritize. I know I already started prioritizing that. Ah, it's like, you know, scatterbrain. We've got so much things going on, but none of time to deal with it all. Uh, all right. So it's fine that we have both things prioritized because we're probably going to need resources anyway. You look at it, uh, oxygen generation is down because I remove uh, a couple of our ways to, to produce it. All right, well. I don't feel like I have much of a choice here, though. Plumbing. We need gas pipe. And I'm going to really have to think about... Alright, so... Just like before, we have intake and outtake. So... This is going to be... Intake. Let me uh, take a look at this, just from a... Liquid pipe standpoint. So... Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. So, intake, outtake, gotcha. Alright, so... Go back over to gas pipe. So, intake air, outtake air. So, we want to have these separate. We're going to have them be two separate lines, so... What I'm going to do... I don't know if they can reach this, to be honest with you. But this goes to there. This goes like that. Okay, so we've got our intake air, we've got our outtake air. 
Aw, you know what? Shoot. That was a mistake. Let's uh, cancel everything accidentally. All right. Let's re uh, let's redo everything we just did. Um, power. No, not power. Uh, utility. There we go. Thermo. Regulator. There we go. All right. Um, in prioritize high priority. All right. Um. Let's get back on to what I wanted to do here, which was the piping. All right, so the reason I realized that might have not worked for us is because we're, we're not giving this a... I'm trying to figure out how to make this intake work better. The outtake makes sense. I just draw a line like that. That That's fine. The, the intake is the problem. I... I want the air to get to both of these, but I don't want to draw it in a way that it can't really do that. Maybe I do something like... Like that. That's not I. It's not the prettiest thing in the world, but maybe it gets the job done. Alright, so that's our intake. I'm going to draw it around as I need it. And then our outtake, I think what I'm going to do is bring it down. That. Okay. And this, their intake air. All right. So now I'm going to have to think about how I'm going to do the, pi the, the, uh, the pump. Okay, so the pump, pump needs to be, pump needs to be in places where we need to adjust the heat. And then we need vents. This is, this is going to be a nightmare. All right. So vents, pumps, vents, pumps. So... All right, let me take a look at temperature gauge. Deselect like this so we can actually see it. This is going to take a lot of figuring, I think. And it's something I may have to take a look at in the next video. Definitely the heat is at its worst up here, but, you know, hot air rises. So I'm not too surprised with that. Then eventually it gets high enough that it, it cools a little bit and then it falls back. I mean, we have warm up here, but that that's just the way the planet works. So it's really warm here. Okay. Still going to need to pump it from here, though. I'm not exactly sure. Maybe I just use the permeable and then it will pump it. This gas pump is huge, too. All right, well, I'm going to put it here. Okay, so let me just let me just start. Let me just start on some of this stuff. Um, first base. Do this. Okay. Then pump, 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 pump. Plumbing. Gas pump. Right there. I can't cram these in here, uh, at least I don't think so. So I'm just going to have to work with what I've got. I don't think it's that warm over here. How, how warm is it over here? I mean, it's warm-ish. So, what the heck, I'll still, I'll still pump. So, I don't have enough resources. Alright, well, what... We'll worry about this in the next video. There's a lot of things I need to do here, but the, the temperature is starting to be a real problem, and I need to work on it. I think I've kind of got the, the system I want to use here. We've got our intake, and we've got our, our outtake. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put pumps around the, the base. And 
I'm going to use that to draw in the intake for our coolers. And then I'm going to come back out with the cooled outtake air. And hopefully, ideally, the idea is we put vents around the base and then it'll pump back in cool air. That's the plan. In any case, uh, I uh, will look forward to that in the next video. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. This is Mouse Gunner signing out.